Hi you guys, I'm back today with another Flashback Friday video and I am super excited to do this one. Let me just say I did kind of like a poll on Instagram to see which one you guys wanted and they were all tied at the time that I was actually getting ready to film this video. So I actually asked my husband what he wanted to see and the one that he had chosen was actually the one that was lowest on the whole list. So this was his second choice and I'm really excited to use this palette. While it is an older palette, I've actually not gotten a chance to use it yet and I'm super excited to share it with you guys. So the palette that I'm talking about is the Lavender chinchilla palette and this is from sigil inspired by tammy tanuka i don't know which way you say that <laughs> and this is the packaging which is like a baby size packaging i love that she offers different sizes and different variances on her palettes i think it is a really economical and smart way to build your collection so this ends up being about 16 well we'll just say we'll round up to 17 dollars usd this is what it looks like it's got the cutest little chinchilla on the front i love the art i think it's adorable and then when you open it up you've got the chinchilla up here again a little bit of embellishments and this is a really beautiful kind of cool ish tone purple palette it does have a little bit of blue to it as well and these two shades in the middle are both kind of shifty they are really nice they look very similar in the pan but on the eye I do find them to be quite different so I'm really excited to swatch these for you guys now as far as shipping went this only took about two weeks to get to me which is pretty darn good especially from Russia so I have no complaints there their customer service is really responsive it is just hard to have communications with them because it's all in Russian and for me you know I only speak English I wish I spoke Russian I wish I spoke lots of languages but unfortunately I do not have that talent <laughs> I wish I did though also, I just wanted to take a second to remind you guys, if you're watching this, maybe consider subscribing. If and hopefully once I get to 2000, I'm going to be doing a giveaway for you guys, and I'm really excited. I think you'll really be happy with it. It is the Club Nebula palette from Kaleidos, and I think it is gorgeous, and I think anybody that gets it would be really happy. I also have a couple little things to throw in. And with that being said, I want to do some swatches for you guys, and then I'm going to do this eye look if you're interested in seeing how I got that. And my final thoughts, just keep watching. All right, you guys, these don't have any names, and so I'm just going to go left to right, top to bottom. This is the very first shade. Please keep in mind that these pans are super tiny, so I can get just the barest bit, part of my finger actually in the pan. Really nice kind of gray tone and shade. Second shade in the palette. Wow. That's so pretty. This is such a unique shade. This is like a gray, green, blue with a slight hint of purple to it. It is so unique. This is the third shade. Kind of slightly pink toned purple shade that also has gray. And this is the fourth shade. And this is a kind of slightly blue tinted purple shade. It definitely looks more blue tinted on the actual eye. This is the fifth shade. And that's part of the most beautiful shades. It's a very purple and blue and green shade. It is so stunning. Sorry, that was really creepily said, but it is so stunning. And this is the last shade in the palette. That's like an ethereal purple with a bit of pink. It's so beautiful. Like, oh my gosh. It is just luminescent. I love it. And this is the whole Lavender Chinchilla palette. And this is as close as I can get without getting my eyes wet. If you know that reference, you're pretty much amazing. So if you do, please leave it down below. <laughs> but this is the palette in low light.
All right, you guys, I am back, and I really hope that those swatches were helpful to you. I seriously really enjoy this palette. I think it is just beautiful, and the fact that Tammy Tanuka actually offers different sizes in this makes me really happy as a consumer, especially as somebody that has a large eyeshadow collection. It is a really appreciated thought to have different sizes available. I think, you know, a lot of us have a, a big collection of eyeshadows, and we'll never get through them. So for me, having this option really makes me happy. So with that being said, this is the Lavender Chinchilla palette. Well, that's as close to like the actual uh, translation that I can get <laughs> and this is what it looks like this one this, I got the smaller size and it is palm size. It is so cute It's about $17 USD when you open it up It is this beautiful like kind of cool toned purple with a slight hint of blue to it and I I just think she does I think she does a great job I think that she had I think that Tammy Tanuka has a real eye for how colors work together. I really enjoy every single thing I've ever gotten from her. Not just that, but her actual product pictures are some of the best I've ever seen. So if you ever get bored, go check out her Etsy or her actual site and you will, I seriously find it to be so aesthetically pleasing. Maybe I'm the only one and that's okay. I'm, I'm oftentimes by myself when it comes to my thoughts and I have no issues with that. It is actually in stock right now. So if you are interested in this, rarely do I find that her palettes last very long in stock on her website. I would absolutely go check it out. I do not think you'll be disappointed and I am so excited that I finally got a chance to use this because it is just so perfect and I definitely think you know especially if you travel this is like the perfect size for travels so in any case I really hope that this video was fun for you guys I hope that you will consider subscribing because I would love to see you win a giveaway that I'm going to be having shortly and I hope that everybody is doing really well thank you to everybody that reached out to me about my cat he is doing a lot better right now he's actually sleeping off to the side and uh he's looking a lot better so I'm really happy about that because I was really concerned I'm really glad that he's better because he is like another child to me and I literally do not take loss well. In fact, the anniversary of the loss of one of my cats is coming up and it's heartbreaking to me because he was like the best cat ever. He was very much like a dog and he was my best friend. He went on trips with me, like he rode in the car, he'd go to hotels with me. He was just like one really cool cat. So with that being said, I really appreciate you guys. All the messages that anybody's ever taken the time to even just send my way, thinking about me, thinking about my pets, thinking about my family. You guys are awesome. I'm so glad to talk to such nice people. It really means the world to me and I hope all of you you guys are doing really well too and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.